Welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Who's this lady? Is this lady I already talked to? That's right. Got a place you should check out then. There's this guy, a real fishing enthusiast, putting around in a skiff at the base of the mountain. He's near an Imperial camp. Mind seeing if he's alright? Yeah, no problem. Much appreciated. Recruit the mysterious fisherman. There's definitely something I can do with those. I see that chest up there too. Uh, I don't know. We'll come back for that, obviously. What do we got? Yeah, because I was up there. I guess I could fast travel. Yeah, let's fast travel real quick and grab that. Let's stop for a moment. Fast travel not allowed. Why? All right. Let's go. Why is it not allowed? Alright, well, I guess we're not doing that. Um, where do we need to go? Yeah, see, I can't... I can't do that. I want to... What is that saying? Block that. All right, let's go. Tantalor is real. And it may be the last corner of this galaxy that's safe from the Empire. I wish you could have seen it too, BD. I actually didn't want to. I think we just found our ticket out of here. This? Easy. We won't hurt you. <laughs> Neko mounts. I guess they can probably walk up this. Yeah. Look at this. Do here. Oh wow, that boy can jump. Let's go. You got it. What am I supposed to do? I'm confused. Huh? Necker scratches. We'll get around faster now. Here we go. What am I supposed to do? Is it obvious and I'm just dumb? I mean, that's usually the case. What? Maybe I go back? Yeah, that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay. 
figured it out. Come on. I bet we can clear that gate with a little boost from our new friend. Don't need the Neko. Are these friendly dudes? Yeah, they're a bunch of Nekos. Cool. Oh, it's like a town. Village, whatever you want to call it. That looked like something I was supposed to collect. What was it? A sand crawler. You know what that means. Jawas can't be far off. Jawas. Clearly not going down that way. Here they are. There who are? Oh, the Jawas. Ancient. Older than anything else we've seen on Kobo. I need to go trade with uh, that Doma person. strength well, that jacket's kind of clean Sorry, I'm not I'm not a huge fan of it, but whatever. Oh. 
Thanks, BD. I see this here. I know it's gonna blow me. So what do I gotta do with that? Slow, maybe? Or do I just need to jump closer to it? What am I doing wrong here? This is blowing me away. What? I don't understand. Hey. I don't how do I get past this thing? It's not giving me a hint either. Like I'd take a hint right now. What in the world? Or do I not go this way? Maybe I don't go this way right now. Yeah, I just don't go this way. Oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, I thought that was the way I was supposed to go, but I guess it's just not. I spent so much time messing with that when I can go this way. Although we're going back to the Mantis, I think, aren't we? Looks like the Mantis is back in action. Come on, BD. Let's meet him at the landing pad. I'm sure there's a ton of stuff in here. Take a look. There's nothing in here? We'll do a little bit of exploring here. Because once we get on the Mantis, I assume we're going to probably go somewhere else, so... Trade this at Doma's shop.
can't. That's. Let's go this way. We no scanning, okay, BD. No scanning what? Oh, hey, look where I am. It's down here. Been in here? Where does this go? Alignment control center. We'll check this out for a minute. Let's move, BD. Wonder what this is, buddy. It may not be something I can do right now. Impressive. So, this is your kingdom. I work with many talented scientists. None as talented as you, Centauri. And yet we've reached an impasse. Perhaps he will bring me some much-needed luck. Not bad for an abandoned facility. yet. Yeah, it's blocked. Okay. That's fine. I kind of figured I probably wouldn't be able to do anything with it. Is this open? No. Alright, let's get to the mantis. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do that, but I thought we did it. Sorry if you hear my two-year-old. He just woke up from his nap. He's not like screaming, but he's thumping his freaking crib against the wall. He does that all the time. He can get out. Like he's, he's not stuck in there. It's a toddler bed. Like the crib rail is a toddler rail. He can just get out and open his door. He doesn't though for some reason in a nap time. 
now in the middle of the night or early in the morning at like six o'clock in the morning yeah he'll get out and come right to our bed but for some reason for nap time he doesn't get out I don't know why Z you're looking good as new indeed that mechanical mixologist is a miracle worker <laughs> I must know did you locate the key to Tannenor? Uh, it's complicated, but we'll find it. Monk told me what transpired while I was asleep. To think the Jedi Order is no more, that must have been dreadful for you. We have both been through so much. We're going to end this episode in just a few minutes. It's going to be a little short, but he's awake, so I can't really. That's right. Got room for one more? I shall remain here, but if you need my counsel, I will be at the saloon. I am very fortunate to have met you, Count Kestis. Sure are. I found something out there. Oh yeah, what do you got? Another holocron? Jedi. From the time of the High Republic, somehow preserved in Bacta. Dagon Gera. I freed him. What happened? He attacked me. Escaped with the Bedlam Raiders. He's who they've been looking for. I didn't even think about Jedi back to him. chamber. That's what that was. Turn to the dark side. Are you okay, kid? Tantalor. It's real grease. It's hidden somewhere in the abyss. Oh, that's impossible! The abyss eats any ship that gets too close! The Republic found a way through hundreds of years ago. That's why they built that array in the forest. A hidden world that nobody has been able to reach for centuries. If you figured out how to cross the abyss, you could just disappear. Completely. No Bedlam Raiders. No bounty hunters. No Galactic Empire. I'm just spitballing here, but that does sound like a place that someone could call home. Yeah. Yeah, it could be a home. Get your feet down. Ah. All right, I'm going back to the cantina. You know, Grease, we could use a real pilot. I don't know. I mean, you're doing okay on your own. I mean, you could clean the Patoli weave every now and again. We don't know the Mantis like you do. Nobody does. Oh, Cal, I'm, I'm sorry. My best days are behind me. I, I can't even hold my card steady. I know things are different from how they used to be, but I'm not sure I could do this without you. Is that really how you feel? It is. Well, I mean, I guess I could have Monk keep his eye on the saloon. Greasy money. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you in? I mean, there's not going to be much in the way of credits. Cal, this is better than any score. Imagine, no more looking over your shoulder. A safe place for us, for the ones we love. If anyone knows about a lost Jedi world, it's here. Jedi! Aha! It's about time you paid that lady a visit. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make us some food before we go. We're gonna get the whole crew back together? Seems that way. All right, well, like I said, I'm gonna have to end back to the outpost. Don't forget to visit domains with any rare minerals you found. Plant seeds in the rooftop garden. Cal can meet more new residents who can help improve the outpost. Z shop, the upper floor of Pilar and Saloon is now accessible. High Republic data disks found across the galaxy can be spent here. Garden on the saloon rooftop is now accessible. Seeds collected across Kobo can be planted here. Alright, cool. It seems like there's a lot more stuff to do in this than there was in the first game. Alright, so anyway, we gotta... Um, We'll save this stuff for the next episode when I have time to do it, when, you know, my child's not making noise. So, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you did, and subscribe if you want to. I will see you in the next episode. Have a good one.